Yo, what's up, sexy Sam Lander squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. We're doing try hard Thursday um, on Friday because yesterday I didn't upload because I, I planned on streaming Cyberpunk and it was going to be sick. And then, um, <clears throat> and then my 1080 Ti graphics card decided that my computer is not good enough to actually stream it. So I could play it just fine. Like in game, I was getting perfect FPS, but uh, but I couldn't stream it because my stream got like six, and it was arguably a slideshow. So that ended up being a complete failure and oversight on my behalf of not checking it. So I apologize for that. It was supposed to be sick, and it ended up being laughable. Either way, it's okay because I'm I'm doing the video today. You know. It's fine, no worries. We're cool. We're all cool, everyone's cool. Alright, he's doing blue buff. Because his gold went up slower. Because blue buff is hecka tankier. Hecka tankier. Alright, he thinks, he thinks he's cool. Okay, he's actually kind of cool. We got Bracer, though. Which is better for early game, worse for late game. Good damage. Okay. I'm fine with this. I am okay with this. Hmm. Hmm. I believe. But I'm just going to try to do this blue buff. Okay. He is there. That was actually really good. And the reason that was so good is because... It was damage to him, which, you know, is alright, but I'm feeling, I'm feeling okay about this, you know? As long as I don't get stunned. Okay, I got stunned. Oh, one HP, dude. He literally had one HP. That's so, so jank. And he missed his jump too. I Aegis because I assumed he was going to jump pillar. Or he, he was going to jump stun me. And then ult me afterwards. So I Aegis the jump stun combo. And I was going to try to juke the ult. But instead he just missed his jump. Which I assume is on accident. Because I Aegis while he was in the air. There's no way he could have predicted that right. But he missed his jump. And then. Um, just immediately ulted without stunning. So, not the best. Nice. I'm all about that trade. I have no mana, which sucks, but it happens. Looks like he's just going to run back. All right, what's the lead looking like? Actually in my favor, which is surprising. But I did get the red buff, so maybe it's a, maybe that's why. But I do have a gold lead even though I died. We have quite literally the exact same build. The reason I dropped pillar there is because I want all the gold for the wave. Best way to do a uh, hello, you scared me. Best way to do that is um. Oh, he wants my blue. I fucked up here. This feels bad. In order to win this. 
fight, I'm, it's going to require an immense amount of outplay. Like, it's going to require a pillar stun before he can jump. Or, he's just going to give me my blue buff because he's too scared of dying. Alright, cool. I'll take it. Uh, there's literally no reason on the planet why he should have done that, by the way. He, he had every capability to win that fight. And he just gave it up. But, I'm happy about it. I was thinking about going Breastplate. Because going Breastplate right now would guarantee me at least one, one fight. But, you can have a one fight without getting a kill, you know what I mean? So, even though it guarantees me a one fight, it doesn't guarantee me a kill. And it needs to guarantee me a kill, so it's a little bit risky. Because if I, if I commit to that and I don't get the kill, then I'm basically saying, okay, all of my lead is in a defensive item, you may now stack before me. And that is very bad. Oh shit. Alright. Honestly, I'm down for that, dude. That seems good to me. Alt for Bracer? I'm about that. And I can back and get my Transcendence start? Hell yeah. This is, uh, even though we died early, man, we're ahead in XP, we're ahead in gold, and we are ahead in pressure. This is looking good. And we have the better late game relic too. Assuming I get anti heal, that is. Ah, that was dumb. That was stupid. That was really stupid. That was really fucking dumb. I jumped in. Got hit for an extra 200 damage that definitely did not need to be hit for. Oh. Damn, he's low though. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> We're pretty much just clearing right now. We have the exact same build online. Literally identical. Alright. He got his tier 1 defense. So he actually is in the lead of these fights right now. Slightly. But he is. been down for a while so I'm happy that he thought that I wasn't and what I'm even happier about is that he doesn't know the timer on red buff I believe he's backing right now which is so so good oh my god that scared the f I, I I did you see me jump oh my god dude I saw I, I just died, dude. Oh my... Holy fucking god. Smite's a horror game. I actually just lost tower. And my all of my lead. Because Smite's a horror game. Holy fuck. That scared me so much. The reason it scared me is because I saw him ping on this ward here. He pinged right here. But he was looking this way. Which means he went like this to come steal red. Because for some reason he heard me doing it. Or he got the timer on it somehow. Which literally none of it makes sense. 
Holy fucking god, that scared me. A monument to my opulence. A monument to my opulence. Oh my goodness. He's so far ahead of me now, it's ridiculous. Off one kill. Off, off literally one jump scare. He might have won this entire fucking game. That's incredible. He does so much more damage than me because he was able to. He got red buff and he's able to keep his. His thingamabob. Alright. Grab this. Grab thorns. My goodness, dude. I'm still trying to mentally recover from that nonsense. Alright, he can't, uh... Can't come over here right now. I popped thorns, but he doesn't even have a second relic yet, so we're good. I would love to take tower here to even the playing field. I stopped his clear, which is amazing. Alright. We got his ult. And we're gonna get tower. It's really good. That's all it needs. This spawns. You take my blue, I take yours. Pitch of all is 1800, so I don't have enough. Not yet. You got his thorns online. You doing bull demon right now? You were. Okay. Well, I think that's all right, because I finished my Jabal. He still has not finished his, so I'm not in a bad spot to fight this. Obviously, he has buffs, and I don't, so that kind of fucking blows, but Itchaval is quite a buff. Yep. Okay. I think I'm okay with this based off the fact that he has no minions. I guess he just got them there though. Hmm. I did get the kill. Does it lead to anything? I don't think it leads to anything. I mean, it leads to some XP in my favor. Which is definitely nothing to scoff at, but I don't think it's enough.
I need another 400 gold. I need to get my toxic blade right now. Mm. I'm gonna have to farm for a wave before I can get it. Thank God he's letting me. I also want an oboe. But Toxic Blade comes first. I assume he's probably going like another defensive item or... Oh, he's going oboe. Alright, well that's what I was going to say. Okay. I will 100% take that. Okay. Did a little bit of damage, but he also didn't do enough to where it's scary, so. I did get Oboe though. A monument, my opulence. Oh. You know what would actually be really good? A Frostbound. I'm gonna get Frostbound instead of Oboe. This might bite me in the ass. Because it means he has so much more attack speed than me, but... We'll see. Very nice. That was that was clean as fuck. That was so clean, dude. So clean. I don't think I can get his phoenix off of it, but I can get his buffs. Actually, actually, I can get the Phoenix off of it. How much is this? Sixteen Alright, I just completely outplayed him there. That was so good, dude. That was so good. And actually, I think because I'm winning now, instead of trying to backpedal and, and poke him out, I think I'm going to just go Oboe. Because now, I have way better clear than him. Because I have fire minions and it's hard for him to clear with fire minions, right? A monument to my opulence. A monument to my opulence. Alright, that was so good, dude. I'll just kill him with Oboe. GG, dude. GG, what a hell of a first game. And on her mirror, I threw... I threw the first two kills. Like, both kills on that he got on me were just like, I didn't know what the hell was happening. But...
It's okay, because we uh, we made a comeback. I'll see you in the next game. Jeez, that scared me. What's up? Low gang. <laughs> hey, hey guys. <laughs> Second game, we're back. I decided that I would like... Oh, nice. I would like um, to play Vulcan, so that's what I'm doing. It's also a little bit scary, considering the fact that this man has built an anti-heal. But also, when I have max cooldown, I can just boink boink away, you know? I should be able to boink boink away. Or maybe not, who knows. You will have a really hard time if I max turret this game. I'll actually have such a difficult time if I max turret. I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to put two points in the one just so I can clear effectively. But I am definitely going to max my turret next. Yo, Vulcan's clear is so nice. His buff clear. You don't lose, like, any health or mana at all. Flop that motherfucker down. Look at that. Look at that. He jumps in the clear and just fucking dies, dude. Minion. Alright, well. There's everything he has. Okay, first blood. Vulcan, baby! Oh god. Ow. Have the turret tank this one for me. Here we go. Nice stuff, dude. Nice stuff. Look at how annoying the turret is for a Kukulin. It's so good. Fuck out of here. He avoids the turret and walks into me. Or he gets hit by the turret and just fucking dies. <laughs> I'm gonna transform again. Um. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to sit back here and ult the next wave. See ya, gamer. I'm not maxing my turret. I'm a bitch, dude. I really want to, but like, I'm too beta. I'm too nervous that it won't work. Get away from my turret. Dude, he's low HP. When did I get a kill? I remember. You know what? I'll max my turret second. How about that? We'll meet in the middle. Thank you, blue buff. Thanks, blueby. Yo, 
how can I still not clear minions as a level 8 Vulcan? Look at that thing just beat his ass. <laughs> Thank you, turret, my boy. <laughs> Turned him three times for 320 damage. Oh my god. kill. Dude, he should surrender. This isn't going anywhere for him. I have no mana. This isn't going anywhere for me right now. Actually, I kind of beat his ass. <laughs> oh, got the red buff. I'll take it. Fucking demon. Fuck out of here, dude. This is my blue buff. Aren't you just gonna die? Got him. We lived. There we go. Okay. Honestly, I was coming this way to farm my buffs anyways, so I'm down. Place that there. You'll deal with the speed buff for me. Places here. All right, breastplate. And I'm gonna go sprint as well. One sprint helps me get away from him. Two, he has horrific, so it just counters his relic. So I'll take it. I'll take it. We can also completely destroy Bull Demon as Vulcan, so that's pretty nice. I do a lot of damage, huh? It's a little obnoxious. I missed. Yeah. My red buff. I didn't get it. Color me triggered. You cannot beat me. Oh, that was weird. Thank you. 
Okay. All right, boys, we did it. That was a little bit back and forth, a lot more back and forth than I was hoping it would be, but that's okay because we did it anyways. And now we go do Bull Demon. Unless his blue is up. Okay, we do his blue. And we go Divine because he got Soul Eater. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> he got Sprint as well, and he got Ansile. I have a Discord message. Who messaged me? Why did you message me that, weirdo? I feel like he's just going to be running most of the game. Yeah, this, this, this seems insane to me. Okay, cool. Let's get Bull Demon. Dude, with my turret, this thing dies so quick. As a mage, like, I don't think anyone actually... Or... I guess not anyone. Merlin could probably outdo a Vulcan, but... It's close, man. It's close. Vulcan's turret does so much damage. And it's so good for zoning, too. Like, I'm barely even... I'm barely even really doing anything when it comes to fighting him. I'm just placing my turret down and then like walking around it while throwing my abilities at him. Unfortunately, I am still a mage, so Bull Demon doesn't guarantee Phoenix unless I get minion waves to it. And it seems like that's going to be his ultimate goal to stop me from getting minion waves to it. He altered my wave. Okay. Alright, cool. I have 30 seconds left to push. Which means I probably will not get Phoenix. Because I can't do it without minions. So. It sucks. It does mean he successfully stopped my push. Maybe I'll go Polly. Yeah, that sucks. Alting waves. Says the Vulcan. Probably gonna all predictable, I guess. Okay, I just completely fucking comboed the Schnikes out of him. Nice. That should be Phoenix. Maybe game, depending on how fast I can get Phoenix. Because once I get Phoenix, I can just place turret down by Titan and, um,. Run away, and that'll do a lot of damage. Hmm. Definitely not game, but... Some decent damage, maybe. Turret is hitting Titan, so... Yeah, did about 1500 damage by the look of it.
Um, I think I'm gonna focus on move speed now, and I'm gonna go do more. Cause right now I'm, he got beat stick online, so obviously he wants to stop some of my life steal. And he's not tanky at all. With only Ansile, he has 119 defense, and I, I'm as a mage, I have more than him, so. Not worried about that stuff. So I'm gonna go speed buff and do more. And that way, I should be able to just outrun him if a fight goes south. Which I'm hoping it doesn't, but we'll see. And um, yeah, he's gonna have a hard time clearing wave. He's gonna have to alt it. Meanwhile, I can just kinda run at him. Big damage. Big damage. Holy. Holy. Alright. GG. GG. He tried to stop me, but um, I full comboed him so hard in the beginning of that fight that there's just no way he recovered. On to the third game, I guess. All games have been pretty good today so far. He's not set. 100%. Easy. Easy. Oh, God, that's so lucky. I'm so glad he didn't pick set. <laughs> All right. Oh, it's the guy that I just killed eight times. He's playing Anubis now. I'm going to start first item Divine, second item Pestilence, and um, third item I'll get Boots. I actually think that's the play. Or I could even just steal his blue. Because I got long fucking range. I got I got big arms. I got long arms of the law. I'm fucking slow. <laughs> oh, he's double buffing. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, fuck. Thanks, idiot. See you later, Gustapo. I missed literally all of those. I mean, you know, at least I have good clear. At least I have good clear. And... And it doesn't scare me that much. Even though maybe he should. Oh, he's gonna wrap. Never mind. Oh, he shelled. Dude, thought this so OP. This character is so busted. You just do whatever the hell you want and then kill them. Like, as a mage against another mage who can clear very well, I focused him. And I still. I'm gonna ult him. I missed! Oh, I could dash in and kill him. Oh, I could. Oh, I could. Oh, I could. He ran away. Oh, but he's still here. Okay, 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 okay. I can't get close. I I don't do it right. I don't, I don't do that right. It seems dumb.
Okay. We're living life on the edge. I'm gonna go back. I'm just, I'm just gonna get my divine. Be the, be the good little boy that my mama taught me to be, and fucking farm. Where is he? He doing a red buff? He's not that nuts, right? No, nobody's. Nobody's that nuts. You have 12 HP against a Thoth and you're gonna overstay your welcome to get red buff. Nobody's that crazy. Unless. No, he's blue buff, okay. Holy damage. Get him! <laughs> it actually got him! <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> Unexpected, but I'll take it. Yo, I'm doing so much damage to this tower. I'm also doing so much damage to him. Okay, well. There's his shell ult. Boots one and I don't. Juke it. Kill. I can't kill him. Can't kill the wave though. And actually, what's up? What's up? Darn. I know I said I was going to go Pestilence second, but I want to get Boots because I don't like the fact that I'm slow and it just guarantees his wraps for him. It makes me feel extremely vulnerable, like I'm naked in the shower and the lights turn off. Oh, he actually landed the wrap. Yeah, it's happened multiple times to me. It's terrible. What? Okay, so basically, it's happened maybe three times. One time was not Shiv. One time was actually... Okay, what? Hold on, let me deal with this nonsense. One time, the power actually went out while I was in the shower. <laughs> and it was the worst experience of my entire life. Because there's nothing like being wet in an enclosed area where you can't see anything. And naked. And then also in darkness. It's actually terrifying. That being said. Um, well, I was going to say that being said, it wasn't actually the worst experience of my life. But disregarding any kind of painful experience, it absolutely was. I'm fucking dead! Never mind. I'm amazing. Can I kill him? Place your bets. One in the one in the comment section for yes, two for no. Am I fucking blue buff? You, you sly little bitch. Did Doth just say this one highlights my ass sets? Later. Really? Your you said that? So, unfortunately, I'm Thoth. So I can't do Bull Demon without dying six to seven times during the process. So, 
that does mean I'm gonna have to be slightly obnoxious and um, just sit here like this and like kind of AFK pretty much. There's quite literally nothing else I can do, so I'm just gonna... You know, if I get a few hundred damage every time... Maybe I won't take that long. He's gonna fucking kill me. Can I kill him? Fast. He shelled. He was... He wasn't confident. gonna take so fucking long I'm actually I'm actually thinking what if I just build some attack speed oh god he's fast Tower. You really just blink through tower, huh? He's fucking mad, dude. Why are you so mad? I like what I see. I like what I see. Imagine blinking through a tower to not kill somebody to then do a hundred damage to their tower. Vegas. Oh my good god damn do I do a lot of damage with my ult. How much did that do? 800? Is that what I just saw? And I have minions too? I'll take the shit out of this thing. Let's do this buddies. And I'm tanking. Let's do this. This is not gonna work. Okay. Got a tech, got a tech, got a tech, got a tech. Got a tech, got a tech. I think he really wants a blue buff. So you're just gonna, you're just gonna. Die and okay. Well, if that was the plan from the start, you followed it to the T. I can't do anything, dude. I kill him so much. So I was gonna say so many times, but then I was gonna say so much, and then don't just don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Let me just clear this. I go back, I get my Toxic Blade so I can potentially... Potentially... <laughs> potentially take his... Darn Tootin Phoenix. With all my newfound attachments. Oh babe, he thinks he's gonna get this. Watch, 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 watch. And it's mine. Call me a bully. Alright, he's Anubis, so. Ooh, he backed! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let me do all my damage. All my fucking damage. Boom, auto attack, 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 boom, auto attack. I did like a thousand damage. That's so gamer. I have no lifesteal though, I just noticed. That's not game. Not lifesteal, not gamer. He's gonna blink over the wall, isn't he? That was it. That did sound like the first one, didn't it? Alright, I'll run. Give me this.
I really am thinking about going poly. Thanks for the text. I knew he was going to blink on me, which is why I was holding my ability for so long, but what I didn't think was that the blink would still hit me even after um, my dash. That was unexpected. <clears throat> See, what cooldown do I have? I need a Chronos Pendant. I do have my poly now though, so there is a chance of getting a phoenix. Oh, he got the fence, that shit made him tanky. Again, I'm pretty much just going to be poking the tower down with auto attacks using Pestilence. Or not Pestilence. Using um, Polynomicon. I don't really care about... Uh, I don't really care about killing him. The goal is not to kill. The goal is to get Phoenix. Every time I land a poly auto, while I have minions in there, it's an extra 100 damage to the tower for free, basically, which is huge. Blink wrapped, it had 5 HP left. That shit literally had 5 HP. That's annoying. Get Chronos Pendant. I don't think I can kill him anymore, by the way. I think it's too late. Um, Anubis has become Anubis, so. No more killing for me. However... I can get his Phoenix and try to pressure Titan, even if it is slightly. I'm gonna have to put my other headphone on for this one. Phoenix down. That's really good. You got the vine, even though I have no life steal. I mean, I have Polynomicon, but that's not much at all. 
Now I can focus on trying to fight him again. Which probably won't work, but... If I had a bead zack, so I didn't, I would just die for free. How do I get minions in? I think I actually have to kill him. Don't blink on me. Max cooldown. I went from 10% to max cooldown in one back, which is very nice, but also like my damage just isn't there because I have a toxic blade. However, now that I have Phoenix down, I don't need toxic blade anymore. I can change that into like like a rod or something. That hurts. That was a lot of damage. Fuck, dude. Okay, well, I could have just lost the game right there. So nervous. You know what? I'm actually I'm actually gonna get a Bancrofts. Um, having no relics up really fucking blows, especially when they do have relics up, your opponent. I think if I'm to win this game, which I'm definitely not the favorite in. But if I were to win this game, it needs to be really long and calculated, and I don't know if... I have the brain capacity for it. Alright, that was so fucking good though.
Okay, I got the kill. I have no minions though. But I do have Bancrofts. Half of the Titan is dead. Yes. I can't believe I won that game. I, I mean, I had six kills to my one death, but like, I still can't believe I won that game. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. That is going to be the ending to it. Um... I love you guys. I appreciate you watching. Hope you enjoyed. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, peace.